a really fun little creation, kind of unique, the peace symbol. And it's gonna use four balloons for the actual peace symbol, and then I'm gonna put it on top of a, uh, like a wand that you can wave around. All right, let's get started. So the first part of the peace symbol would be the center, the one single balloon that goes right down the center. And this is kind of tricky to get the proportions correct, so I'm gonna leave myself a lot of room here with a lot of balloon left over. We can always break off the extra as needed. So that's gonna be the center of the piece symbol. And this is going to be, I guess you call it the crossbar or the cross part of the piece symbol that goes right like that. Now this is where it's gonna be tricky. You have to sort of yeah, see where these things are gonna land proportionately. Let's make the sidebar about this long on this one. It's about one, two, three hands of length. So I'm gonna go one side of the piece bar and then make two ear twists. And then the other side of the piece bar is gonna be so that these are the same length. All right, tie that off. And get rid of that extra piece. So this is going to be just about there. Eh, kind of eyeballing it, let's see. You're gonna take the center piece and connect it like this so that the two ear twists come look like that. And eventually that's how it's going to look. Got it? Crossed. Let's go ahead and take two more balloons. I'm gonna make them different colors so that you can see what's going on. And it looks more colorful, I think, this way. Let's do that one. Blow it up almost all the way. But again, you're probably gonna have some left over so we can break off whatever we don't need. Take these two balloons and tie the, twist the ends together so that you have this. All right. Now, this is gonna be the bottom of our circle for the piece symbol, which needs to connect to the center piece. So let's take the bottom, twist off a little bubble for the center piece, and connect that little bubble to the bottom of the circle by simply twisting around. Now, we have something that looks like this. I'm gonna take these orange pieces, and again, it's sort of eyeballing it, the proportion, so you have big triangles, just like this, one on either side. I'm gonna start with one side, here's the triangle, and we're gonna connect with a little bubble into the triangle. There's one triangle on the one side, and now here is the other triangle on the other side. It's about the same size, right? Little bubble, about the same size, and connect it around by twisting that little bubble around the circle. So now we have the bottom part of the piece symbol. We're gonna come right up on the top, and because the piece symbol is a nice big circle, you're gonna to have to kind of eyeball this to make sure it's nice and straight. Can you see it? And I think that's about right. We're just gonna connect it right there by twisting around a portion. Wow, I was really close on that one. And the other side, you're gonna come right around and even it out so it's a big circle. Can you see that? Looks like one big circle. Go ahead and twist it off at the top. That was really close. Right. Takes a little practice, but eventually you get it. And now you have a big circle with the peace symbol. I'm gonna take this last portion. We don't need any more of this off the top. Break it off. Tie it down. Put the knot inside. Now I'm gonna attach a little wand to the bottom of this peace symbol, just so I can have a little handle for it. Very simple thing to do. Inflated third balloon, fourth balloon, fifth balloon, whatever this is. <clears throat> Make a little ear twist at the top, which is a bubble connecting the two ends. One more ear twist, bubble connecting the two ends. 
I don't need the rest of this balloon, so I can break it off and tie. And I can connect this right to the bottom of the circle so that my handle is adjusted and it looks like this. Peace.